What's up, YouTube? Now, I theorized a way that we could actually make a wormhole. This is based off how electro I mean, magnetic fields actually, if you put them close enough, will put them on each other, will, will open a magnetic portal. Now, I'm speculating that to that general relativity, how it states that massive objects in, put an indentation in space-time. So here we have really big black holes. Really big black holes with that are at least 100,000 trillion times the size of the black hole in our galaxy. Now this is if you want to actually get somewhere in space, like, well, to the closest star, Proxima Centauri, of the Centauri, the Alpha Centauri system. Then you have the center between those two. And then you have, on the edge, is where you would want, on the edges of the, that, in between them, you would want to fold the space-time. So what you would do is take an array of dark energy beams directly at that and in there at all at the same time to cause it to fold over like that. Which would in turn, if it gets close enough, the fields would combine making a wormhole. Pretty simple theory. right now the thing is now I don't remember your name but you replied to my comment on Mikio Kaku's how to I mean explain I mean explaining string theory or string theory explained or whatever now in order to do this across the two universes, you would just need more mass, more gravity, more energy than is in both of the universes combined, which makes it completely impractical. You would have to take the mass from literally thousands of universes, because the distance between I mean, just the distance between galaxies, the nearest galaxy that's like ours, the Andromeda Galaxy, that's trillions of miles away. So think between the universes, that's just going to be like more than deca over 100 decatillion miles away or something like that, so, well light years, like at least 100 decatillion, which is just completely impractical. It won't do shit. And yeah. Even if we could get to the universe, like you said, what if there are different laws of physics there that are completely different and our spacecraft wouldn't work there? So yeah. We would pretty much be stuck there. Once the wormhole closes. So, I'm not trying to be mean. I'm, just, I'm not trying to be rude at all. I'm just trying to explain how everything would key out in this situation so yeah peace out hope this explained it well enough if there's if you have any questions don't hesitate to put it in the comments below i will most likely reply well, I, well to all my comments i have replied so far on all my other videos so don't hesitate to comment. I will reply. I 100% guarantee it that I will reply after the first month or so. So, bye. Peace out. And like I said again, I hope this explained it well enough for you. And bye.